Good morning, final community. Tony, Tony LPs are us back again. Took a day off from doing videos. It just did a couple of shorts that we're really happy with. Just uh, sharing some of the collection. Uh, YouTube now allows you to do uh, a minute or 15 seconds of copyrighted material that's on their list. So I'm able to use the songs and show the album at the same time, which is great. But this video is something special. Uh, glad I could share this about, I don't know, over 10 years ago. This was October 11th of 2012. Pete Townsend was going to be in New Jersey uh, signing his memoir, which was called Who Am I? And that's right here. Pete Townsend is great. If you don't have this, pick this up. It's really, really good if you, if you, especially if you, if you're a Who fan or Pete fan or or a fan of rock and roll. So uh, Pete was going to be in town. He was going to be signing his books, and of course, the ad indicated only books are being signed. You must buy the book. At, at uh, this this bookstore was uh, Bookends in Ridgewood, New Jersey, famous store not too far from New York. So we get a lot of of talent that's able to come over the bridge and uh, sign their books in New Jersey, which is really cool. So I saw some, some great people there signing and got books. But anyway, you know, big article, Pete Townsend's going to be there Thursday night on the, on the 11th. Uh, but we'll only sign his book that you buy at Bridgewood. We'll not sign any albums. We'll not sign any memorabilia. Boom. That's, that's usually the standard. You can't have people bringing in all their memorabilia at this point. You know, these artists are there for, uh, well, you know, it's, it's a, it's a fan, it's a fan service. They also sell books. They, they, they make their money. Uh, Bridgewater, uh, I mean, um, Ridgewood makes their money and uh, et cetera. So I understand that, but what I was going to do, I was going to bring a few albums to give to Pete Townsend for his, for me to him being a, a, a fan my whole life. And uh, just to show you here, here's the autograph book that I still, of course, I kept, I have right there. That's Pete's signature, hard to Im uh, emulate there, right there. And that's Pete Townsend's book. Like I said, it's a great book. So anyway, so I'm waiting in line. I'm, you know, there's uh, hundreds of people in line. The line goes around the block. It's You start there at... Uh, Two o'clock in the afternoon, I think doors open at four or whatever. It's a few hours, but it moves pretty quickly. And you could buy your books ahead of time. So I bought a bunch of books. I was giving them away as Christmas presents as well. So anyway, so I have my albums in my uh, little bag. And I finally get up there. And uh, by the way, here's just a uh, quick uh, YouTube uh, shot. I'm in that line, but you can't see me there. But someone took a... A quick shot there just of the crowd and no for no photos with pete were allowed but you could take candidates i may have a candidate somewhere in the archives i have to dig that out but anyway i i get to the counter talk to him for a second you don't have a lot of time they're pushing you along i think i had five books to sign and he signed right in front of you so anyway i'm saying big fan gives them give you know just try to keep it brief and i said i i have some records and no, no, you know, the, you know, Dominic and Rocco, these six foot four New Jersey guys come out of the, out of the sides. Mr. Townsend isn't signing any records. I said, uh, I said, no, ex excuse me, sir. I'm giving these records to Pete Townsend as a fan, as a, as a, um, as a thank you for all the joy he's given us and, and me through, throughout my whole life. And uh, these are the albums. These are, I gave him duplicates of what I have. This was one which he loved to see, Chester and Lester, and that's on RCA. I believe the one I gave him was the same uh, same RCA, Gold. Now, the reason I picked this record out, because it's some some great guitar, some great banjo. And, you know, Pete Townsend's records, a lot of them have banjo, especially Quadrophenia, some of the early stuff, Squeeze Box. And the record I'm going to uh, talk about later, Quadrophenia, was one of my inspirations on what records I was going to pick. The next record I gave him, of course, this is a this is a my copy, was a, a rare print from Laurie Records, the Chiffons. Everything you always wanted to hear by the by the the Chiffons, but couldn't get. 
And uh, this is fantastic. This has on it, he's so fine, one fine day. I love so fine, my boyfriend's back. Will you still love me tomorrow? It's my party, the locomotion, do Ron, Ron, Ron. This is a fabulous album. Here's the uh, flip, flip side. So Pete Townsend has this record in his collection that I gave him. And here's the label. This is a really nice copy. I gave him really nice copies. And the third and last one is a real treasure. He he was overwhelmed. He was really thankful when he saw this. And that is the Ronettes, Veronica. And this is the fabulous Ronettes. Here's the label. This has Be My Baby, Walking in the Rain, So Young, What I Say, When I Saw You, I Wonder, Breaking Up. Now, most of these, I think only two of these songs were not written by the great late Phil Spector. This is also his label, uh, Philly Records, a division of Phil, Spect Phil Spector's, Spector's Records. So that's it. So Pete Townsend was really cool. He shook my hand. He thanked me a few times. And I'm hoping that, you know, in 2012, whenever this was, uh, when was it when I say it was, 2012, these records made it back to Manchester or London or wherever Pete was um, staying at the time. Here's the booklet again. I'm the book. I'm going to show you the autograph one more time. Who am I? That's a really cool book. And I'm going to talk about this record, uh, Quadrophenia, the soundtrack not the original Quadrophenia double record. This is the soundtrack of the film. And I recommend this as an OG pressing with audiophile sound. This has a bunch of early who, which is uh, from the high numbers, cross section, four faces, Joker James, the punk and the Godfather. But on here, which was my inspiration to give him these, these uh, couple of these records, as well as the banjo record was the, uh, Rhythm of the Rain, The Cascades, He's So Fine, The Chiffons, Be My Baby, The Ronettes, and Do, Do, Ron, Ron, Do, Do, Ron, Da, Do, Ron, Ron by The Crystals. So right there, you can see that they loved the early um, female singers of the early 60s, the Phil Spectors, the Philly Sound, the New York Sound, and uh, there's the gay fold, which Sting is in this movie, if you could see him right above the shoulder of the uh, kid riding the bike. And uh, a fantastic album. This has a really beautiful uh, photographed inner, as you can see there. A really nice label with the some of the mod symbols. And let me show you the next one. But this record sounds really good. I love this record. Uh, Night Train is on here by James Brown. The Kingston is on here. Louie Louie. So this is what the who, well, this is what the boys grew up on. This is what Pete Townsend uh, was inspired by. So once again, uh, the Chiffons re recommend it. Pete Townsend recommends it. He, had, he got a free copy. Um, RCA, great album. Chester and Lester, and of course, the classic, and uh, that one there, let me show you the uh, inside, right there. So that's my story. Uh, Pete, if you're out there, God bless, hope everything's going well. I didn't see the last tour, so I've seen The Who. I would say five or six times I saw Quadrophenia, the last tour with Ed Whistle, uh, at least three times, Meadowlands, Garden, and I think the Meadowlands again, and we were really up close. Uh, the Garden had a bunch of uh, guest stars, can't remember who they were, but, you know, famous punk rockers, you know, of, of, uh, of Europe and England. So um, that was it. That's my story of The Who. And the Ronettes, this is a great album. And Pete, thanks again. Hope you're enjoying these records. And if you can see this video, please leave a comment. Really appreciate it. Tony's LPs are out. Are out. Have a nice day. And uh, if you can't, if you can, please subscribe. 
Tell your friends, if you like what you see, check out my shorts. I do a lot of uh, UHQRs, a lot of uh, one steps, and a lot. I start doing some of my uh, 45 singles. Okay, thanks again. Keep rocking. Stay safe. Bye-bye.